All right. Hopefully nobody unsubscribed after the last video. And uh, if they did, hey, they're a piece of shit, so I don't care. That's how you gotta live your life sometimes, my friends. Sometimes you just gotta realize if you offend people over certain things, those people deserve to be offended. And there's certain things that if people are gonna leave their life for, they're gonna leave you for, like, you know. It's okay to let shitty people go. I'll just reiterate that. Anyway, last time a bunch of insane shit happened that I can't even concisely repeat. But we didn't die, and that's what's important. So today, we're gonna try to not die again, I guess. I don't even know. I don't even know what to say. Snow in the forecast? You ready for what's coming your way? Oh no, not snow. Hey, May. You ready this morning? I'm not opening the pickaxe today. Greg and Forza are doing band practice, though. I'll see you there. Hey, man. Last nice messages last night. I mean, like, really. You massive dork little band practice today. Because I feel like we need to do something normal. I'm at the Snalkin. Hope you're feeling okay. Sincerely, Gregory. Alright, let's fail one last band practice. It's good to be alive this morning. That's all. Same. You make the pain go away, Mr. Sharkle. <laughs> Alright, band practice. Now we got a goal, my friends. We're gonna go to band practice and no one's gonna kill us. <laughs> Epilogue. Stars. <laughs> that fucker's arm popped off. They're gonna die alone. They're gonna suffocate in the dark. In a cave, clutching their guns. Dreaming about the past, how things used to be. <laughs> it's perfect. That's how they deserve to die. It's great. May, honey, is that you? Yeah. I'm back in the kitchen, if you want to talk. Okie doke. What's up, moms? Hey, sweetie. Hey, mom. How are you feeling? Good enough to jump up here. Can you do me a favor and stay home tonight? Why? It's been, I just, you're an adult. And you can do whatever you want. But you do live here, and you're still my baby. Aw, Mom. We need to come up with some ground rules. Just because... Honey, you could have died the other night. And then you just left to hang out with your friends? I... I... I'm so sorry, Mom. Uh, we kind of did something important. But, uh, whatever. I had a really tough year, Mom. I don't even know if I can tell you. <laughs> uh, I probably shouldn't tell you. Why? I'll understand, I promise. I don't even know how to talk about it yet, I think. What happened at school, hon? I don't care what it is, just please, tell me. Are you working today? No, me and your father are both off today. I'll be around tonight. We can talk about it then? Sure. I think we make breakfast for dinner like we used to. Oh no. I just realized Granddad was one of those fuckers. Aw oh, man. I hope he joined before they started doing that crazy shit. Maybe it wasn't... Dad can flip the pancakes in the air. Haha, <laughs> sure. Are you going out today? Yeah. Can you please stay in town? Yeah, Mom. I think they're getting some of the longest night decorations out. Oh, wow. Calling for some snow, too. That went fast. What did? The fall. It always does, hon. Okay, well. I'm off. I love you, sweetie. Love you, too, Mom. Whew. Hey, Dad. I was a little worried that Dad might be one of those. That would be a dick move to pull, but that's fine. No work today? I told Bob to shove it. Really? No. You okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. I hate my job. Aw, oh, Dad, why? I've mined, I've made glass, done a heap of other stuff. But this place, they just don't respect you for working. They don't? Job's supposed to pay you enough to live. Job's supposed to let you provide for your family. Job's supposed to have regular hours. Job's supposed to respect you. Workers are supposed to be able to talk. They're supposed to have, able to have a life. We're supposed to be able to live. I always had to work, but I wanted to give you and her our time. I wanted you to have her to have hobbies. And enough time and money to do them. That's what made me happy. Now I just work so I can keep our health insurance. Hold on to the house. Try to, at least. Is there anything you can do? 
I mean, we do need a union. It's just easier to say that than get it done. I just realized we never saw those two other pentagrams. That star made me realize. The unions always were in the mines in the factory, at least for a while. Here. I got something for you. Got it out of the basement. Why don't you get in the basement? Door in the crawl space. That's spooky. Why would you give him the tooth? A what? Do you know what this tooth is? No, really? You sure? Grandpa must have had it from the old days. May. Thank you. Wow, looks bright and new. Like they just pulled that out of school yesterday. Show that to your boss and tell him to eat shit. May! Sorry. I'll just keep it with me. Sure thing. May, yeah? You come down here and pick us it pick it with us if we walk out? I will breathe fire, Dad. Love you, kitten. Be back later, Dad. Why did we give him the tooth? Weren't those freaks the tooth freaks? Why would I want to associate my dad with them? Maybe that was a different thing. But that definitely seemed like that's what I figured they were. What are you doing out here, by the way? Getting an earlier start on our longest night's plan. Gotta dig him out of the closet. See if they even work still. May I help you put them up? We'll see. You're a small fry. Dad. Dum dee dum. Well. Time for me to fail one last band practice. Oh wait, let's... Three weird teens. What's with the... There's no third... What What pentagram? What, what's What's with the pentagrams? Legends. Greg Reels, okay? Angus is good. Angus is very good. New <laughs> awesome strings. Smash. Halloween. Harfest. Spooky. Hello, B. Did you get my texts? <laughs> That's my favorite one. Skull hole! Little Joe's dang skull. Is this why a spirit wanders? Must he be avenged? Saw him. Ah, oh, that was just that asshole. I guess that's what we drew in that one thing that I missed. Like, that I couldn't see during the whole drama. Everything feels bad. Friends. I guess we pretty... We filled it out pretty well, didn't we? I've thought of making a journal on occasion, but I really did. What's up, Selmers? You okay? After the whole like head injury thing? Yeah, I'm alright. Headache is all. I got some migraine meds if you need it. Nah, it's not a migraine. Those things make me have to pee. It's the caffeine. If you ever take pills that make you pee, it's the caffeine. I didn't know that. I used to work at the pharmacy. Oh, alright. So caffeine makes you pee? I didn't know that. If I have a headache and need to pee, I'll come by anytime, neighbor. What do you got to say? No, coming. Gonna be real bad this year. He's just accepted that I will be on his porch. He... Our lily rank has risen to the level where he is now fine with me being on his roof. May can't be this chubby with like this much exercise. I should start doing my start doing my own laundry sometime. <laughs> There's no way I'd get away with not doing my own laundry if I were to go back to my parents. Help! Bonk. Hey May. Hey Mr. Chaskov. Got any more dust stars we can look at? One more. What do you mean one? Why? This is your only- this is your own fault at this point, I would say. Found it! Let us consult the guide. Oh, it's Mr. Coldhands, man. Legendary. The Firemaker. The Firemaker? A wonder in the cold and dark. Making a fire and hold, huddling up to it for light and warmth. Sounds festive. Sounds like survival. Ah. Uh, the star makes me want to cry. Crying on my roof? Do you wish to talk about it? No, it's fine. Is it a happy cry or a sad cry? I don't know. I don't have great words for it. It is okay. Sometimes too many words. Yeah. Thank you for this. Thank you for joining me. Huh. Thanks, Jeskov. So what now? Super moon is coming. What is that? A giant moon! Oh, that does sound super. You must come meet me when that happens. It will be late at night. There will be others on the roofs. Come, I will make the hot chocolate. I don't think I can get on my roof. I have an access to my attic that I've actually never been in. My entire second floor is still waiting on renovations, actually, so I can barely go up there. 
Well, you just sealed off some stuff for, because of bats. Which, one still got in. I don't know freaking how. I'm so tired of getting bats out of my house. I never want to see another bat again. Anyway, you come, I will make the hot chocolate. What a time! That sounds great! I want to see a super moon. Plan on it. See you later, Mr. Janscob. See you soon, Stargazer. Alright. So yeah, for all my worries, I guess we did... We did do quite a few things. I wonder what that thing with Greg would have been, though. Exploring the old whatever the hell. I mean, it probably just would have ended up with... Aw, oh, poor Casey. It plays the physics noise every time. Man. Cute little bug. Alright. Band time. Let's head to the Snalkin. I just realized, isn't it weird, like, with everything being animal based? Oh no, I forgot to check on the bum. Yeah, I forgot about that little subplot. There's lots of plot threads going on. I like that, but I don't want to miss things either, so that aspect has me a little less excited. What was I saying? Oh yeah, but the, this, this, the, wait, what's this? It'll look a lot friendlier when he's covered in snow. It's, it reminds me of Reginald from, uh, from Nedroid, the, that webcomic with Bertado and Reginald. He reminds me of Reginald from that thing with Reginald. What the hell? Where'd he go? Hey. Well, hey there, May. What are you doing? Oh, just cleaning up. Do you know where Bruce went? I don't know, May. Wish I did. Need some help cleaning this place up? That'd be nice, May. There's a rake back in the shed behind the church. Oh, I can't do it now, but <laughs> run along, May. Huh. That's interesting. Well, if Bruce was in the mine, I don't care that he's dead. He doesn't seem like the kind of person that would be there, though. Also, why would his shack have disappeared? Strange. I wonder if that was going somewhere, or... Oh, hey, it's already snowing! Oh, no! Oh, this reminds me. It's, it's kind of just kidding cold again. It was really, like, unseasonably warm for a bit here. Then it got cold again. Then it got pretty nice again. And I'm not sure if it's ever going to snow again this year. Probably not. I mean, it's... End of February now. It's probably gonna be a freaking March by the time you watch this. Definitely gonna be March. Um, it's weird. I, I guess I shouldn't ask this so late into a series, but like, would people prefer like for a super long series like this? Should I just do it one video a day, or should I do like multiple videos? Cause like, I don't. Where'd your head go? Rest in peace, head. I didn't do that. When did? When did Head disappear? She's still there? She's still there? Hold on, I wanna go up here. Oh yeah, but isn't it weird that like, things are named after like, birds and like, like, snack falcon and stuff? That's like, that's like having like, snack black guy. Like, 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 animals are like races. Oh, it's a doggo! Screw you, dog. Um, oh hey, there's some uh, graffiti here. Hello, salutations. Greetings, genius. You're dumb. Oh my god. Charlene, I love you. Hat. That's my favorite. Hat. Oh, maybe that's cat. No, I'm just gonna pretend it's cat. It's hat. Goat lung. Deathy. S plus F. Jill. Is that a, is that a, Oh no, that's just... Wait, who's that? What the f There's a person up there! What the fuck? Is that Bruce? Wait, why is there a person up there? I'm glad I ventured up here, because what the hell. All of these roofs are like coming apart. What are you doing here, kid? All right, hold on, I think I need to triple jump. Nope, fuck, okay. One, two, three. Hey, you okay? Hey, I heard you like in the hospital or something? Haha, <laughs> yeah, all four. Fell into a ravine while running in the woods at night. Why? Uh, chased by a death cult of conservative uncles. <laughs> Alright, you don't have to tell me. <laughs> yeah, 
you uh, you want to hang out sometime? Isn't that what we're doing? I mean, like, we could watch horror movies. You can meet my sister. She's, like, almost your age. What's her name? I probably... What's her name? I probably know her from school. Stevie Myers. You probably don't know her. She beat up someone and had to go to a different school. Oh, cool. We might get along. <laughs> probably. She's mean, but sometimes she's cool. Sounds good. I gotta get going. It's been a weird past couple of days. Weird's good. Not this kind of weird. Well, I mean, I guess it is good. I mean, we killed the bad guys. Later, killer. <laughs> you don't know how accurate that is, boy. There we go. Oh, how did this cat get up here? I mean, I got hit up here, but still. It was quite the trek. 1901. <laughs> Burbs in the background. Party burn! Oh wait, I need to talk to that old guy. He seemed to have knowledge. Knowledge beyond his years. Hey, it's you. Yep, yep. For now at least. You know, I never got your name. I'm the janitor. I clean up, do fix-its, whatever needs done. Oh, okay. So what's it been like being home again? Things like you remember? Uh, no. I don't know. I don't even remember today. Sounds like you've been through something. How'd you know? Got all experience. I swear some mornings feel every bit as old as these trees. You know, something big did happen. I feel like I should have woken up today and, like, have learned something. But I don't know if I learned anything, really. Well, my experience of big things don't teach you anything. But they make you something. Sometimes you gotta wait for a while to see what comes of it. Huh. Well, done an honest day's work, quitting time. Smelters game tonight. See you around. Not if I see you first, mate. Ha <laughs> ha. I like that guy. I was kind of expecting there'd be a dr big dramatic. Wait, how do you know my name? How do we? How do you not know someone like that? Janitor, Mr. Janitor, Lord Janitor, Bob Janitor. Thought I could get a job as a janitor and really enjoy it. You're supposed to, like, fix things, not break things as a janitor may. I don't think you understand how that works. I was kind of expecting we would, like, find someone turns up missing. Like, like about a dozen people died. That fucking cat. The moving cat bugs me so much more than the sleepy cat. I don't know why that was open if no one was in there. Holy crap, we got a taco buck! Hell yeah! A, ah, a taco place! This is the best thing that's happened in this town since they got rid of all those snakes in the diner. So we got internet. We're still using Cyberfish until like two years ago. Because it's eternally two decades behind here. It takes you three days to tour in a movie. It takes you one day to load a GIF. Barbaric times. Get the fucking cat. God. Life moves on, huh? Oh my god, they deliver. <gasps> A taco place that delivers? I would gain 8 billion pounds. I'm gonna eat the shit out of some tacos. Hopefully not literally. Taco Buck now hiring. Oh, you poor son of a bitch. So now you're a taco dude now? I was hired to become a taco artesian. But I guess that means holding the sign out in the snow. It's not really snowing that hard. It's snowing. There's snow in the sky. Falling. How are the tacos here? Good. I like tacos. There's not one person on God's earth that who doesn't love tacos. Bad news, my ex hate tacos. Are you sure your ex is a person? Good news, they're now your ex. <laughs> Have fun with the tacos. Eh, it pays. How you doing, my friend? Taco Buck, dine in, dine out, we deliver. Please tip your delivery persons. Best tacos in the general region, pretty sure. You missing the pizza place? Why not try a pizza taco? Oh wow, that sounds amazing. That sounds kind of disgusting. Watching your health? Try our all lettuce taco. Ugh. Get out of here, kid. I'm working. Wait, what happened to the dude? Do you not even have dialogue? Oh, there we go. Who are you? Have you seen me around? Nah. Well, I've noticed you. That's not weird or anything. It's a bit cold outside for standing outside, isn't it? Someone's got to stand here. Hey, you a Smelters fan? Sure, buddy. Oh, really? Ah, uh, yeah. Go smelters. Go smelters. Go smelters. 
same. It's the good old Snalkin. Let's check out the tunnel real quick. It's ahead of that pierogi asshole. Hey teens! How do you do, fellow kids? What are you guys doing? Nothing. Cool. Hey guys. Yeah? Stay safe, alright? Wow, thanks mom. Are you our new mom? Apparently. Life, man. It goes. Slowly. Nah, dude. Nah. <laughs> Bad news. He's still alive. Hey, buddy. Oh, it's the it's the it's the tunnel fish, dude. When when winter come and water freeze, here the fish can be at ease. The tunnel is not flooded ruin. It's home, a place for doing. Sure, that works. Please go away. <laughs> oh, poor May. And now I want pretzels. I always want pretzels. I don't know if we have good good pretzel place around here. I don't really like to go out for food, though, unless I'm, like, already with people. And there's not too many people around here. Not that I know, anyway. Ugh. Meeting people's weird when you're not, like, small bab. Hell, I never... <laughs> I was never good at meeting people when I was a small bab. I just had to. Can we go to the diner? Nope. Well... I wonder if we're ever gonna, like, tell the police. Nah, it's fine. A dozen people show up missing. They were assholes anyway. Sup, Greg? But look who's alive in the well. Is that a surprise? Nah. Just seems, like, relevant. Well, look who's alive in the well to you, too. Yeah. Yeah. Awkward silence. You wanna get out of here? Do band practice? Yeah. Alright, let's fail this band practice. Practice. It's already, it hasn't even started, I've already failed. All right, let's do this. Birthday zone. Jeez, that door never gets any less stuck. Worse when it's cold somehow. I'm so ready for cold weather. Ugh, I hate winter. Same. Winter's good, actually. Nobody here yet. Bunch of slackers. It's like they don't even want this band to succeed. <laughs> Where would we even play if we wanted to? Hmm. I have no idea. Go play those AVFW hall shows in front of the Fort Lucene. Oh wow, those were fun. We be the oldsters now. Yup. So, uh, you okay? Uh, yeah. I mean, I guess as I can even, as much as I can even tell today. Yeah. Huh, suspicious. Do you think those guys can get out of the mine? I guess we're gonna find out pretty quick. Did you notice anyone missing today? I don't know. But I don't think a lot of those guys are people I knew. Never can tell. Never can tell? This kind of thing happened to you often? Oh, all the time. So like, I don't really get what even happened down there. With you and the whatever that was. The murder cult of dads. The cosmic horror. Yeah, that. Uh, it's old. Something older than I can think of. It's fear of change. It's allegories. And you can feel it inside. It's a hole outside down? Yes. No. Like, the thing in the hole is... Jeez, I lost it. That's okay. The audience gets it. It's like a porch light that's on. There are all these bugs around it. And then the light goes out. There's a hole where the light was. That's what happened to me way back. Like I was telling you about the couch last night. God, that was last night. It seems like two weeks ago. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be weird when you're gone. Well, I mean, you've already been gone. And you've been gone at least once since you got back. You're a goner. Like last night. It feels sometimes like there's so much horrible past and it's still here, like you're swimming in it. And you can't have a future. Nabra. Nabra, that's it. What was our biggest crime ever? Almost burning down the school. Bringing a horrible robot son into the world and then leaving him to haunt the woods out by the highway. Actually, he's probably trapping those dudes in the mine and leaving them to die. Fuck you! That was our greatest victory. That was self-defense. All that stuff, like, today's different now because that happened. We're different. Yeah. So, like, things change. 
I guess. Like you said the other day in the woods, it's gonna be different because we were there. That's something. Something, something, something. They killed Casey. Yeah, they did. They killed Casey. I'm trying not to think about it. Do we, like, tell his parents? What do we tell them? I don't know. Is it worse to let them think he's alive? Or tell them he's in a bottomless hole in a tunnel in the woods? With a bunch of guys who are going to be dead soon. I'd want to know. I don't think they believe you. But, okay. You get to figure out what we say. I'll let you know if I ever come up with anything. Sounds good. I think it's important that we know at least. Makes it mean something. I don't know how to say it. I think we might be the only things in the universe who care about anything. Or who even can care. Do you ever think that this means anything? Or like, meant anything? Hmm. Does it, Gregory? Sometimes it does feel like most people don't give a shit, but... I've found some people to give a shit. I wish I didn't live so distant from them. But... I can talk to them, and... That's what matters. Hey, babies. Hey, hen. Babies. How's work? Jeez, I'm sore from, like, everything. Gotta do stretches. So, like... I can move... Can I move to Bright Harbor with you guys? That seems... Um, I thought you, like, couldn't leave home. Eh, you guys are home enough. Or maybe I'll just visit for a while once you get get settled in. Of course. Yeah, dude, that'd be bad. Hey, guys. Yeah? Thanks for saving me last night. Like, repeatedly. Not even a problem, dude. We'll save you as many times as it takes. Hey, B. Hey, B. Alright, are you gonna say something? I don't really know what to say. What in the hell even happened last night? I don't even, don't ask me. Can we just like play a song and get pizza? And think about this tomorrow? No, let's get tacos, dude! I had a dream the world was ending. Song and pizza. All right, sweet. Oh man, this game really makes me want to go back to my college town and get some of that goddamn, that amazing Greek pizza. Oh, son of a bitch, it's so good. Sometimes my parents head up that way, though, and they bring me back a few. It, it reheats okay. It's not, obviously, as good as fresh, but I guess as far as pizza goes, it's probably the best pizza that I've ever had reheated. Because, I mean, pepperoni, like, nah. Like, anything with meat, really. I think it's the lack of meat and the lack, I think it's the lack of sauce, really. Um, cause it's, you know, it's just got the olive oil and the cheese. It doesn't really have the, uh, the tomato sauce. I think maybe, maybe that helps it a lot. Cause I mean, it's hard to get pizza reheated, right? But with that Greek pizza, you just kind of got to get it so the cheese is melty. Not, you don't want to let the cheese boil, but just, just melty and just warm enough. And it's pretty goddamn good. It does, dude. Answering your own question like two minutes ago. What question? What were you even talking about? I'm sorry, I totally lost that with the whole real life. Oh! <laughs> Suddenly credits. I don't have to play the, the song then. It's just gonna... Okay. Well, that was Night in the Woods. That was great. I think this falls just short of being my longest Let's Play ever in terms of number of videos. Um, Valhalla is slightly longer. But hey, this was one hell of a game. I really enjoyed it. Um, dang. I don't know if I can like totally review it immediately after that like that, but the mini games really add a lot because it just feels like you're really doing stuff. It doesn't feel like, you know, it feels like it really is giving you the whole slice of life. It feels like it's, you know, it feels real. And it's not just random major events happening. Like, there's proper build-up, there's real drama, there's real interactions between people. You feel like you're really going out and doing stuff with with the mini-games and everything. It feels organic, it really feels like there really were... Like, you know, there was stuff I could have done that I didn't do. There was the third pentagram. Um, 
I don't know what they said to do about the third pentagram, but yeah, this was fantastic. Um, this is by the. It was a Kickstarter game by Infinite Fall. Took a while to come out, but hey, any Kickstarter game, take their estimate, add a year or two. Uh, if you're not ready to wait until two years after the estimated date, don't back it. Like seriously, Kickstarters are almost always late. Uh, they're often well over a year late. It's just, you know, I, I, I'm not upset by, you know, I'm not a, a dissatisfied backer. I, I didn't mind it taking a couple years. But I do tend to avoid backing things. But I figured I would like this. I knew, well, I knew I would like this. And I did. Then again, I, I thought I would like uh, Mighty Number no. 9. I didn't even play that one. I'm not going to play that one. I got other shit to play. I don't even care. Uh, I wasted like 60 bucks on that. At the end of everything, it's Sharkle! Aww. <laughs> Three weird teens I met. Unless you go over the journal one more time. How about that allegorical villain, huh? <laughs> Your parents forgot you! Well, that was a night in the woods. I hope you enjoyed as much as I did. They're also beta testing some kind of patch I saw on Twitter just between episodes. I don't know what the patch is for. I didn't really have any major issues, but maybe if it's better loading times, that'd be awesome. What happens if I hit continue? Oh, is this just the same scene again? Jeez, that door never gets any less stuck. Yep, so... No epilogue, you just... Er, well, that was the epilogue. No... You just go back to the thing, and I guess you gotta erase your save data if you wanna play again. Oh, did I read this? When you... F yeah, I think I did. When you feel out of control, remember that you always have options. Yes. Well, that was my night in the woods. Oh. If you saw any cool things that I didn't, um, feel free to let me know in the comments. I always love hearing like what, anything I missed in a game. Just don't be a dick about it. Like, I hate when people are like, oh my god, how could you possibly miss that? You know, it, when you're in the forest, you know, there's a two pixel sized leaf that you press the A button on 47 times, obviously, and uh, then you get the super secret ending. How could you not do that, you stupid moron? How do you not know this? It's like just let me know what I missed. Don't be a dick, you know, just, just don't be a dick. It's not hard. It's so not hard. Uh, anyway, that was Night in the Woods. Thank you so much for watching. You guys are great.